Hello, it's Fun Day Monday, and I have a fun project for us to get started on this week. We are going to do self-portraits. However, our self-portrait is going to be a photograph, so that should be pretty cool and easy and fun for you. I would like to receive a photo of you. Now our photo is going to be considered a quarantine portrait, which means it's going to be a photo of you during this quarantine time where we have been stuck at home for the last six weeks. So what I would like for you to do is follow the directions here on Seesaw, and I want you to have your parent take a photo of you so that you can submit it to me as your quarantine self-portrait. Now, we don't just want any simple photograph of you, you know, whatever it is that you guys do. <laughs> I want your portrait to tell a story. I want it to tell me what you've been up to these past six weeks. So there are things that you need to include in your photograph. I have a list of items, but what would be really great for you to include are things that you will remind you of this time. Maybe the favorite outfit or your favorite sweatshirt or sweatpants or pajamas that you wore most of the time. You can include your favorite stuffed animal or maybe a blanket that you snuggled up in a lot or a favorite toy. You should include the device that you're using to do all of your schoolwork, like a laptop or an iPad. If you listen to a lot of music, maybe include your iPod or a phone. Include your favorite book or a book that you've been reading during this time. It should be a reflection of what's going on. Maybe if you're like me, you've been eating a little too much, so I may or may not have included some Oreo cookies in my picture. As you can see, I have chosen an area in my home that has really good lighting and a nice, simple background. I grabbed all the items that I listed. I have hobbies that I have been doing over the quarantine, my sketchbook, some books. I painted my living room and my dining room, so I have a gallon of paint and the paint swatches. I have my favorite snack, my favorite blanket, my favorite pillow. I have my laptop. On my iPad there, you can see my TV show that I watched a series on Netflix over break that I just loved. And I have all the items that sum up this six weeks of quarantine. That's what I'm looking for. My favorite part of being stuck here at home is being able to spend time with my little June bug, my granddaughter. So I included her in my self-portrait as well. You can grab any of the items you like, lay them out the way I did here, and then plant yourself in the middle of it and have your parent help you get a nice, clear photo. There's some other ideas for you at the end with some images of other quarantine self-portraits I found on the internet. You can include anything that's going to tell me something about you and the time you've been spending. I want you to think about all the items on the list, gather them all up, and have your parents take a photo of you with all of these items so we can have a quarantine self-portrait. Parents, please make sure that you find a spot that has really good lighting, a nice simple background, and send me here on Seesaw a really nice, clear, crisp photo. I'm really looking forward to see your quarantine self-portraits. And I think this is something that your parents will probably like to keep. And maybe you could make one for your brother and sister or everyone in your family. So enjoy. I miss you. And I can't wait to see your quarantine self-portraits.